Hello, welcome back to Vet Mythbusters. I'm your host, Dr. Mike, and today I've got another co-host. His name is Tank. He's a 10-year-old little pup. He's going to help me with today's myth. Now, a lot of people will come to me and say, my dog is limping, but I don't think he's in pain. And it made me realize a lot of people really don't understand or know how to tell when their dogs are in pain. And so I want to give you a few hints to see how that does work out. Now, dogs, whenever they are limping, almost always it is due to being in pain. Dogs are pretty stoic. They don't like to tell people that they're in pain, so they kind of hide it. So if they're limping but they're not crying out or they're not wincing when you touch them, it doesn't mean they're not in pain. If they're limping, you probably are uh, pretty sure that they are going to be in pain. Now, other ways that dogs can show pain include just slowing down. They just don't go for the walks. They don't want to go for their walks. They're not coming up the stairs to hang out with you at nighttime at bedtime, or they're just not doing the stairs at all. They're not coming up on the couch. A lot of people think, oh, they're just getting a little, a little bit lazy. or They just don't want to be around, but it could be. These are subtle signs that your dog is in pain. So if you do see any of these signs, you want to be sure to realize, hey, maybe there's something more to it than him being lazy or just you know not being in pain, and have us evaluate him to see if they might be in pain so we can improve their quality of life. Thank you, and have a great day. If you like this video, please like us, subscribe to us. You can see us on Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. And remember, let me do the prescribing, you do the subscribing.